the comments that said spark plug wires off. One guy said, "Do I have a flat cap it tam? Flat tap it cam? Flat tap it cap it tam? Tap it tap it cam? Flat tap it." Cam. Flat tap it. He said that it, with it running like that, it may have flattened it, but I don't, I don't No, know. you probably have a roller rocker, roller cam. Yeah, you have a roller, I think. That is what is at the bottom. No, I think I have flat. I bet you don't. No, I, don't I don't think all those little lifters are rollers on the bottom. They may be, though. Man, it's been forever since I did that. <laughs> I think they're rollers. I think they are, too. But the real deal is we went through and checked firing order and two wires were off. We have three and four reversed. Firing order was like four, three, and we had it three, four. So they were crossed one on each side. So they'd load up with fuel and pop. Bang, 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 bang. So we had a six cylinder for a while. <laughs> hey, we're gonna hear a V8 today, hopefully. Yes, sir. You like that? Yep. All right. All right. Good. Hey, uh, let's make sure the fan's sucking the right way. Hook up juice, we'll power on and Oh, got the castle. This is fine. And then what okay. do we need to do? We just verify that it's running at 2,000 RPMs and just let it run and cook off all that stuff? Yeah, it'll... I, I, I really don't know how to break in a motor. I just thought... Uh, this can't be laying on it. Is that fuel line? Yeah, that's fuel line. Is that okay on the alternator there? Yeah, it can touch there, but uh, I'm gonna address fine with this. all the wires yeah, later. Fine. You can pull that off and just run it out the back if you want. Yeah, that's the way it should be. I don't know why it's running to the front. Oh, of course, we got this. What's on? What's on the end of it? Is the hose loose? No. I get wrapped around a spark plug wire too. Pull that wire. Exhaust. As long as it's not gonna cook. Red and white. We got white here. Just jumpered together. Don't touch. You want to put some tape around that? Okay. So it doesn't. Yeah, I got electrical tape. So it doesn't vibrate and spark. Oh, uh, this is gonna cook right here. Hey, you'd be surprised. These things are freaking pretty good. Pretty heat resistant. Yeah. Mine are right next to my headers too. Are they? Okay. Yeah, I ran those down because they were. Oh, you pull them out, you're putting them in the top again. Yeah. Well, I think it'll melt them. Yeah, boy, that is tight there. See? Why well, pull them out? Didn't like it. I see. Put them out there in the free air. Okay. That feels better. I don't want to turn this on and see the fans are working. <laughs> Fuel pump's working. This is just gonna cook. Uh, I guess it's low. Yeah, okay. Okay. Hold on, I gotta, I gotta do computer stuff. Yeah. And the fuel's just wired straight. Yeah. Yeah, don't turn it off because I almost flipped it off. <laughs> uh, the ignition? Yeah, he's setting up the computer. Yep. Yeah, so it's all top dead center and everything. It should fire up and then you can set all the timing up there. believe I will. Well, I thought the motor was on or something because it's heat yeah. right here. <laughs> That's where he needs all those. Golly! I had a set for 440 and, and went to 1562. It's not a 1562. It is not. Could be. Might want to take that. 
door up a little higher to fan if the smoke starts <laughs> billowing up. Oh, yeah, that's true. Golly, went to 1569 again. Settle down. You got your fat thumbs in there. This is like the worst human interface system I've ever done. Yeah, they now with the Sniper 2 had that big screen. Five inch. It's still small, but. Or they have an app. You can get yeah. an app to do it on your phone. Oh, really? Attachment for this. What's our idle speed? 850 sound fine? Yeah, probably. Mm -hmm. Golly, 1960 is where it jumped. 870 is what it is. That's fine. And I don't know what the wide open timing is. I think it's 50 something. Put it at 40. Put it at 40 or 45. I want to. I want to pull that forward. When I hit that button, I don't want it to be going down. Yeah. Huh? So I want to raise this up. Oh, higher. then I'll block it. Okay. Go ahead. Okay. That good. be good. Smokes and that's it'll blow it out. Okay, please cycle the engine to complete the operation. Okay, let me see what it saves here. Come on. Operation complete finish. Off on. Off. Off. Yep. On. Okay. I, I didn't hear it. It might be full enough. It may not be any air bubbles, which is probably what Okay. You yeah, you do the honors this time. All I did was ever mess it up. Okay. <laughs>
can't leave. Okay, so I need some. <laughs> okay, so I need to buy some new spark plug wires, huh? <laughs> Thought you said those were flame retardant plugs. I mine, on a 289. <laughs> mine are like uh, flame persistent plugs. <laughs> Boy, those are the worst plug wires I've ever seen in my life. Dude, they're... I think they're made out of gasoline. <laughs> <laughs> Petroleum products. Uh, okay, how long did it run? Did we break it in yet? <laughs> wow. Yeah, it's hot. Don't... Yeah, no, don't... They're, they're toast. Don't try to grab it with your fingers. Well, you get... Uh, third degree burns. Yeah, you did. I did. Yeah. Yeah, that's cool. Boy, that paint was terrible on there. Yeah, no kidding. We got it hot enough, long enough to just about burn all the spark plug wires off. Pretty much. That's pretty good. Now we got a chance to wire the spark plugs wrong again. Yeah. yeah. I think the temperature said two, 200 on here. Well, Did it? it okay. Say? That one's still reached close. Uh, this is hot, so. So that made you fairly cool. Is that hot too? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. This is hot. Good. It was it was doing what it was supposed to. But the tack doesn't work right on there. Yeah, I wonder why. I don't know. That's weird. It's working fine on the computer and that's all what I need. What did the tack say? It was okay. saying like a thousand. No, no, it wasn't even up there. It was like okay. eight eight or nine hundred. Yeah, weird. Yeah. You're gonna have to put asbestos sleeves on those things. Yeah, something. Yeah, or that's terrible. Find a better way to route them. Yeah, pull them Even tight. Just and temporary. A couple standoffs. Can't wow. have my spark plug wires. Yeah, so much for you. On fire. Some, Did some. you do these headers? You buy them. I bought them. That way. Yeah. I think water will just evaporate off the spray on there, even now. Nope. A little bit, a little bit, but it's still, it's bubbling. Temporarily. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. If you want to take my wire, man, you can order me one. What are you saying? Take your wire kit? It's like a 12 or 13 piece kit. Oh, I like that. Look at that. It's got all the standoffs. And it shows. So we don't have flaming spark plug wires? <laughs> it's all the shows where they go. Yeah, it's got 66 on here too. Here it is for 1966. But here's where they are. Half bracket, 
mean, look at all these standoff things for the wires. See, there's a, that would go, but that's a regular uh, exhaust manifold. That's not for a header. Yeah, true. Okay, well, we can make use of them. I'll, I'll buy one of those kits. Okay. You just got that? Yeah, I just got it. All right, I need that. Well. Okay, what do you think, Doug? Yeah, I don't see any, no water leaking, dripping, seeping. Pressure gauge here is now tight. It's not dripping. Yeah, that, that had a little puddle. Yeah, it's not seeping there anymore. See what the oil pressure was when it was running? 60-ish. Oh, maybe a good. little high. That's maybe good. a little higher than 60. That's unbelievable. That probably yeah, it cooked it. Yeah, you need you need one that's that braided asbestos that far on the end. I've seen them before. Too. Yeah, I have too. They're made for headers. These aren't. And maybe I should wrap the headers in some of that. Yeah, you Teflon. You probably could. I, I don't find that very attractive. Neither do I, but I <laughs> I don't like flaming spark plug wires. Yeah. I just saw more stuff come off of there. I know. Look at all that. All that stuff in the bottom. Yeah. All that black. That's from there. Boy, it's not very it well ceramic off. coated. No. Yeah, I don't I don't know I if it's ceramic it's coated or I just painted. I would have thought it would have just changed colors and that's it. No, no that somebody off. somebody rattle can painted that black. Yep. <laughs> you didn't buy these new? No, I bought oh, them okay. at, I bought them at swap meat. Ah. There's what you get for swap meat yeah. vines, rattle can paint. That Krylon flaked off. <laughs> <laughs> Walmart. This is it. I'm out of here. This is freaking hot. Uh, but started right up. No popping. We revved it. Yeah, I, I imagine oh, if you push the button, it'd start right bang. Oh, yeah. yeah, it would. It'd fire right back up. Which is weird because your Mustang vapor locks. Yeah. We need you to want figure to see out. if it'll fire right back up and turn yeah. it off? Start it up. Yeah, yeah, fire it up. Sure. Turn on the uh, fuel and the tack. a little more gas. Dude, that sounds so awesome. <laughs> yeah, it goes up to about 60 when you rev yeah. the PSI. This did get up to about 2,000 when we were revving it. You were probably at three or 4,000. Maybe. Yeah. yeah, probably. No, you have a, I you have love a monitor it. right there. Yeah. There was also something once you got it started to go through there too. Yeah. We don't have any of that dialed in because no, I'm not- we gotta stop the flames first. I'm not <laughs> smart enough yet. <laughs> Okay, very cool. Stop the flames. <laughs> Stop the flames. All right, let's see your wire brackets. These are... We're going to employ some wire brackets the next time we run the motor. <laughs> yeah, we're also going to buy some uh, wrap heat shields. And I know we probably should have done that, but we didn't think we needed it I until think everything have... caught on fire flaming spark plug wires but yeah this has all the locations of where i mean some of them are weird looking like what are they for i mean we know they're for spark plugs but there's all different angles <laughs> so this ought to be a nice set i'll so, get some wire shields and some exhaust shields yeah you need to order all this stuff you'd be very happy said on the sticker that these were ceramic coated but they lied. I think Krylon did the job <laughs> could have been DuPont yeah, it could have been <laughs> but I think pretty well sealed I didn't see anything yeah, maybe, really leaking maybe a maybe maybe that gasket. I might need to redo that 
But all but yeah, uh, all the others looked good. I didn't see any other dripping. Yeah. Oil. No water. water. And this didn't. That didn't puddle no. there either. Didn't puddle there it's anymore. Still hot. A little warm. Still a little warm, but yeah, she runs and runs. I think runs pretty darn good. Yeah, sounds, sounds like it. Nice. I was it's impressed. With your yeah. sniper and. Well, you know, you put all the spark plugs in the right place and it runs decent. Plugs are in the right place. <laughs> yeah. There's the wires that weren't. <laughs> yeah, plugs are in the right place. Okay. Anything else for the engine run video today, Pop? I don't think so. I think that pretty well wraps it up. We'll do another quick video of once you get all that done, or maybe yeah. even showing how we wrap it. And uh, We're going to bust a wrap. Yeah, we are. <laughs> Sounds good.